The date of the Catalan independence referendum is drawing ever closer, with the Spanish government now warning regional police will seize control of any polling stations ahead of this weekend's vote. Madrid deems the process is illegal. Catalonia's regional government, though, insists it'll go ahead and has sent out notifications to Catalans to staff the vote booths nonetheless. The referendum will ask Catalans if they wish the northeastern region to become an independent state. The dispute has plunged the country into one of its biggest political crises since democracy was restored four decades ago. Spain's government said on Tuesday that all the referendum's logistics should be dismantled, adding that anyone with keys or entrance codes to a polling station could be considered as collaborating with crimes of disobedience, malfeasance and misappropriation of funds. Previous threats from Madrid have proked mass demonstrations and accusations from Catalan leaders that central governments resorting to the repression of the Franco dictatorship. There's a very evident desire by the prosecutor's office, the Ministry of the Interior and by the Prime Minister, Mr Rajoy, to create tension, to provoke altercations, to generate indignation among citizens in order to provoke a rapture within society. The Catalan government says it has a concrete plan to make the vote possible, but is not in a position to reveal it. The regional assembly in Barcelona is due to declare independence within 48 hours of a likely yes victory. But the unrelenting opposition from Madrid means that that result would go all but unrecognized elsewhere, plunging the dispute into a damaging new phase.